Hey guys, it's Ryan Coaster Attic here, and welcome to my first park trip of 2020. Today, or this trip, is going to be at Dollywood in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. I've never been so excited for a park trip in my life, just because I probably haven't ridden a roller coaster in around six to eight months. It's been so long, I'm so happy to be back at a park. Never been here before. I'm really excited for Lightning Rod. Lightning Rod's one of my biggest bucket, li bucket list coasters since like the year it opened. And yeah, we got the crew. This is my father. And that is my stepsister, Abby. So we're gonna be going to the park tomorrow, which is gonna be their opening day for the, for the, um, the general public. So I will see you guys in the morning of their opening day. First credit of the trip, Rocky Top Mountain Coaster. Rocky Top Mountain Coaster. Yes, sir. Alright, so we just did the Rocky Top Mountain Coaster um, here in Pigeon Forge. Uh, that was so much fun. That was my first mountain coaster. That was awesome. First coaster in eight months. Did you see that so sign that said no trespassing, we're tired of finding your bodies? Yeah. <laughs> but that was so much fun. Like, that was awesome. If all the mountain coasters are like this, I'm excited to ride more of them. So, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna go get some food, go back to our hotel, and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Credit number 90 is going to be Mountain Bear Mountain Coaster. And apparently they're actually a Rowdy Bear Mountain Coaster. Apparently they're actually building another Alpine Coaster right here. I'm gonna be doing the inverted, the inverted one. So I'm pretty excited for this one. It looks really fun, and it's like half game. So you get to do like games and stuff on this. So I'm pretty excited, let's go ride. You got a gun, you gotta shoot it. Wow! Oh, I got it, okay, I got one, I got one. I have 2300. Oh, God, it breaks! Day two, baby, let's get it. We're going to the park now, after we get some breakfast. About 8.30 in the morning. Park opens at 10, but we're gonna get there a little early just so we can get in, get everything situated. So yeah, I'll see you guys at the park. So as per usual with all the parks in the US now, um, you do a temperature screening before you walk into the park and you have to wear a mask in the park. But luckily at Dollywood, you don't have to wear masks on the rides. So when we're on lightning rides and stuff, we won't have to wear masks, so that's good. So yeah. This is the line just for temperature screenings. Pretty, pretty crazy. All right, so we got our temperatures checked. We're all good. Um, getting into the park. Uh, I can see lightning rod from here. Oh, Thunderhead's going up. Nice. Thunderhead just testing. We just saw lightning rod test. Wild Eagle just tested. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This is gonna be so awesome. Was it perfect? The weather is so nice too. It's like. I'm not, not it's not too hot. It's not too hot. It's not too cold. It's sunny. Key. I'm ready. I'm ready for a good day. We're gonna go right to Lightning Rod. So yeah, I'll see you guys over there. We are in the park, going right to Lightning Rod for my first ride. Oh my gosh! I'm so excited. Oh look! There it is! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, we're going lightning rod. Let's get it. Lightning rod time, baby. This way, Dad. There it is. Oh my God, guys! I'm so excited. It's time for lightning rod. Let's do this. It's lightning rod. Oh, <laughs> they're running two trains. 
Two trains. Oh my god. Let's do this. So yeah, guys, we're about to get on lightning rod. We're in the queue for it right now, and I'm freaking out. Like, this is going to be insane. I'm so excited for this. Looks like one of the top coasters in the world. I'm so excited. So I'll see you guys with my thoughts after the ride. Oh my god! Okay guys, so we just got off a lightning rod in the front row. Um, I am completely lost for words. That was one of the most amazing, most intense coasters I've ever ridden. I think it might be my number one. Actually, it might be my number one. I might, I need to get another ride to ride it, to like get a feel for it, but right now, favorite wooden coaster. That's better than El Toro. That is amazing. So I think we're gonna go head over to um, about Th Thunderhead now, and we're gonna get a ride on that. So I'll see you guys over there. Time um, for Blaze and Fury. It's a blank minute wait. We love that blank minute wait. Can't wait for the in-house dark ride roller coaster. Nothing has a wait right now, it says. It's probably wait for my dad. Oh yeah, it is like a... Look at the wheels. Alright, so we just got off of Blazing Fury, which is like probably the weirdest, one of the weirdest roller coasters I've ever ridden. It was fun. It had literally ejector in the back row on all the drops. Yeah, it's like pitch black. It was pretty fun. I liked it. I would ride it again. But honestly, if there was like more than like a five minute wait, I wouldn't ride it. So, but it was a walk on, so it was good. So, we're gonna go do Tennessee Tornado. So, I'm really excited for Tennessee Tornado because I love our coasters. So, yeah, I'll see you guys after Tennessee Tornado. Uh, time for Tennessee Tornado. It's not that bad of a line, actually. All right, let's do this. Alright, so we just rode um, Tennessee Tornado. Um, that, that's definitely my favorite arrow looper. Like, that was awesome. Um, it was super forceful for an arrow. Like, so intense. That was really good, though. A little short. Too short, but for what it is, it's really good. So, we're gonna go do Wild Eagle now. It'll be my second wing coaster, so I'll see you guys over at Wild Eagle. Wild Eagle time. Second wing coaster, let's go. Oh, they're dispatching. This is your first wing coaster, isn't it? So first wing coaster. <laughs> yeah. This is my second wing coaster. All right, let's go do it. All right, so we just got off a of wild eagle, and um, honestly. Not too bad. I liked it. I think Gatekeeper is still better, but it was it was hauling today. It's running really fast, and I like it a lot. So yeah, we're gonna go do um, Fire Chaser Express now. We're gonna get a ride on that, and then we're gonna go do Thunderhead. So I'll see you guys after Fire Chaser Express. Fire Chaser Express. Track switch. We 
just rode Fire Chaser Express. And um, <laughs> why is the launch on this more forceful than lightning rods? Like, honestly, like, this ride is intense for a family coaster. It's actually, it's really fun though. The backwards part is like more intense than Tempesto. I know. And <laughs> it was fun, I liked it. Probably my favorite girl flower that I've ridden now, because I haven't really ridden many girl flowers, but that's about to change because we're going to do Mystery Mine. So I'll see you guys at Mystery Mine. Time for Mystery Mine. I have pretty high expectations for this one. It looks really good. Oh yeah, yeah. Beyond vertical lift. Vertical lift. Yeah, let's go do Mystery Mine. Time for Mystery Mine. Let's do it. Pretty excited for this one. So, Mystery Mine went down. Um, now they're, it's back up now, but they're cleaning the train, so it's taking a little bit. But we should be on really soon. We're in the station, so probably about like, I don't know, about, about another 10 minutes. So I'll see you guys at the Mystery Mine. Alright, so we just rode Mystery Mine after waiting in line for like an hour because it broke down and they had to wipe the trains down and stuff. But it was good. I enjoyed it. It's probably my favorite Eurofighter now. It's probably my favorite Eurofighter. I enjoyed it a lot. So we're gonna go do Dragonfly now, which is the new for 2019. The coma. So yeah, let's go do it. See you guys over there. It's empty. an empty train. Oh yeah. Ooh, there's no line. Alright, so I just rode Dragonflyer and Whistlepunk Chaser, which is the kiddie coasters. Um, Dragonflyer was good, but uh, Whistlepunk Chaser, best ride here. Um, no, it actually really sucked. It was actually really terrible. I don't recommend it. But we're gonna go do Thunderhead now, which is my last credit I need here. So I'll see you guys at the Thunderhead. Thunderhead time, baby. Let's do this. All right, so we just got off a rain ride on Thunderhead. We did it in the front row. That was relentless as crap. That was so good. So good. Probably second best ride here for sure. Oh, you can just loop around. Cool. Wow. We're doing it again. We're gonna go in the back row now. Wow. We'll try a back row ride, so I'll see you guys after that. <laughs> Alright guys, so we just did a front row on um, Thunderhead and back row on Thunderhead, and we did front row on Wild Eagle in the rain, and then we did the log flume. So as you can see, I'm very, very wet now. So that was, it was fun. Wild Eagle was really good in the front. Thunderhead was awesome, so relentless. So now we're gonna go do Barnstormer and do Lightning Rod again, so I'm really excited. So I'll see you guys after that.
All right, so we just did Bard Stormer once. That was really fun. We love SNS Screaming Swings a lot. So we're gonna do it one more time, and then we're gonna go do Lightning Ride again, because I, I really wanna do Lightning Ride again. So yeah, I'll see you guys over at Lightning Ride. All right, guys, so unfortunately, Lightning Rod is temporarily broken down. But we're gonna go do Tennessee Tornado again. We're trying to get a front row ride on that. So I'll see you guys after Tennessee Tornado. All right, guys, so we are going back to Fire Chaser Express. And we're gonna do that once, and then we're gonna do Tennessee Tornado again. And then we're gonna get some food and then see if Lightning Rod is reopened. Because I really hope it is. So I wanna get another ride on it. So yeah, we're gonna go do Fire Chaser and all that stuff. And I'll see you guys after. Last ride on Fire Chaser Express for today. We're going in the front row, and I'm really excited. This is gonna be our last ride, and then we're gonna head out for today. So yeah, I'll see you guys after this ride. All right, guys, so we just got off of Fire Chaser Express for the last ride. It was pretty good. I like it a lot. It's a really fun family ride. So yeah, this is gonna be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please click the like button down below and subscribe if you are new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. All right guys, so the video is actually not over yet. I'm about to hit my 100th coaster on Goats on the Roof Mountain Coaster. Oh my gosh, this has been a pretty big achievement for a while for me guys. I'm really excited to get 100 coasters ridden in my life. So I'll see you guys after the ride. One hundredth coaster! Yeah! Let's go! Alright guys, so we just got off of Goats on the Roof Mountain Coaster. Um, that was my hundredth roller coaster and that was so much fun. That was like so much better than Rocky Top. Yes, it was. So good. I, you can go so fast. That went like 40 miles an hour. That was crazy. You can go full speed the whole time. But yeah, that was a good 100th. I'm really happy that I got this film in my 100th coaster. So yeah, this is going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys did, please click the like button down below and subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you guys in the next video.